I take that back. It doesn't smell like cherries. So today we have the Lip Addict tag. Stoked to be doing this video. I was tagged by Shannon or ShanXO. If you don't know who she is, you've probably been living under a rock. So that's what we are doing today. Super excited to do this. I got the questions ready to go. Let's get started. Side note, I do have a Shadow and Schmooze Get Ready With Me video on the look I'm wearing right now. So if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that so you don't miss out on that video coming next. All I did was change up the lip color. So on my lips right now is Manic Panics Cross Lip Gloss. And this is like new from them, I'm pretty sure. This is in the shade Black Rose, which is absolutely beautiful. And I ended up mixing it with Whitening Lightning Sugar Mama. And I just love the formula of these. And then with this color on top of it, I feel like it just gives you a nice summery kind of dark berry color so i'm feeling it anyways let's get started the first question is what is your favorite balm or treatment i'm super old school with my balms not a huge fan of baby lips i like the color ones just for the color but the actual formula of it i think it's just way overhyped so i just like to go classic with some old school carmex lip balm i love the smell of this stuff it is super moisturizing i put this on every night before bed i got this for a dollar from dollar tree so you can't go wrong. So the second question is what is your favorite eye-catching red? Most of these I didn't only pick one product because who the fuck can do that? My favorite eye-catching red was super difficult for me because I am all about the reds. My all-time favorite favorite red lip product is the CoverGirl Outlast 523. I Instagrammed a picture of this on 4th of July. This is what I wore. It is just the best red ever. It is a super long lasting formula. It can be a little bit drying so you definitely want to put a balm under it. This stuff doesn't budge, it doesn't transfer. I love this. My second favorite red lipstick is the Milani lipstick and this is in 07 Best Red. Ha. This is a cool toned red. I'll link the video down below where I use this. I think I used it in a Shadow and Schmooze video uh with like elf foundation yeah i think it was that one i shortened it up here because you can't see shit down here this one is just such a beautiful cool toned red makes your teeth look whiter it is 90 degrees outside right now so i'm trying not to turn on the fan for you guys the best luxury and drugstore product this one was hard for me in multiple ways mostly because i don't really have any luxury lip products those are just not the kind of thing that i usually go for spending a lot of money on. So the closest thing to a luxury lip product that I have tried that I really really love is the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick. I have a Shadow and Schmooze video using this. This is a perfect dusty rose color. It stays on. It smells like freaking cake batter. It smells so good. I really love this product and I will be repurchasing more colors. My favorite drugstore lip product. This was super hard for me to answer because like I said I have like 5,000 drugstore favorite lip products. When I think of like one lipstick from the drugstore that really stands out to me it is the Rimmel Kate Moss lipstick in 08 just because I've been using this for I don't even know. I wore it all throughout winter. It's one of those lipsticks that you can wear on an everyday basis and it doesn't look like you're trying too hard and wearing lipstick but it just gives you a little bit of color I didn't breathe that whole sentence it's just the perfect color the Rimmel Kate Moss line is really nice if you're just looking for an easy go-to everyday lip color I would definitely check out this one number four is best Mac lipstick I have two because obviously how do you choose one the first one is Diva. This is just like my favorite color that MAC has ever come out with. It's like a deep berry vampy kind of red. It is just perfect, especially for winter. This is like the one that I would always send customers to. It is perfect. My second one is a matte black lipstick and this is hot core and this was limited edition. I literally think I paid $40 for this because I was like, I cannot not get the one black lipstick that MAC comes out with. I don't think the formula of it is anything spectacular. It's mainly just that like MAC came out with a black lipstick and I feel like I needed it for my collection. Most disappointing lip product. Ooh, I don't even know. I really don't know. Just cleaned out my makeup collection before I moved, so I feel like everything I have right now I like. Gonna have to think about this one. I am so hungry. Burrito sounds bomb.com right now. I'm having a I'm spacing out and really need to eat lunch moment right now, so I'm just gonna leave my least favorite lip product down below once I've had time to think about it. So the next one is lip liner, colon, yes or no. I think that lip liner is necessary if you're wearing a dark lipstick. I can't do dark lips usually without a lip liner. My favorite lip liner for that is by Palladio, and you can get this at Sally Beauty. Waterproof and retractable, and this is in the shade Blackberry. This is a perfect lip liner 
for Diva or this Wet n Wild lipstick, which is called Cabernet. So the next one is my favorite glosses. Before, about three weeks ago, I never used to be a gloss person. I hated the feeling of glosses on my lips. I just couldn't do it. I felt like it was gonna slide all over my lips and I kind of usually like more matte, long-lasting kind of things, so I don't have to be like fussing with it every five minutes. So I never gravitated towards lip glosses. And then Whitening Lightning sent me these Color Your Smile lip glosses. I have more shades back there if you can see. I don't know. I was kind of curious to try them out because I didn't know if it was going to be kind of one of those things that's just very hyped up in the beauty world on YouTube and Instagram. It's not. Shit's real. My two favorite shades I have from them are Sugar Mama, which I used in the Get Ready With Me video before this, and Buttercream. Buttercream is a perfect color if you work and you want something on your lips but you don't want it to be too much. I've been wearing this every day for work and then I just absolutely love Sugar Mama. I don't know what it is. It makes your whole complexion look like brighter and I don't know. It's amazing. I also have these like color technology that makes your teeth look whiter and there's a freaking light on these. Like can you see that? There you go. So these have been my favorite lip glosses. If you want to try them out yourself, I will leave a 25% off code down below off your whole order. So the last question is something else, which could go in so many different ways. So I'm just going to throw out some lip products that didn't fit into any of those categories and my eyes watering. If you've watched any of my videos, you know that I'm totally a black lipstick person. I love it. Can't get enough of it. I wish I could wear it to work. My two favorite black lipsticks are the Pretty Zombie Cosmetics Black Cat, and this is a matte liquid lipstick. You definitely need a black lip liner with this because it can be a little bit difficult to work with because of the doe foot applicator. This is actually pretty affordable. I think it's like $12 or something from their website. My second favorite black lipstick is by Manic Panic, and look at the packaging. So cute. It says it's a satin black lipstick. I find that it looks matte on your lips, but it feels very moisturizing and doesn't feel drying like a lot of black lipsticks tend to feel which is why I really like it. Number two for my favorite black lipsticks. So that was everything. All the videos I mentioned will be linked down below if you want to see those and thanks again Shannon for tagging me in this video. Love you girl. If you like this video and you want me to do more tag videos because I think I've literally done maybe two tag videos ever on my channel. If you want to see more of those be sure to give this video a thumbs up so I know. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye. They should invent a way of drinking coffee that goes inside your lips so you don't have to get it everywhere. Probably called a straw. I really want some. Score.